thanks for joining me for another episode of Raging with Matt. What the fuck is wrong with you fucking assholes? You can't use your fucking blinker. It's a fucking lever. You put it up or down, that's it. Why can't you fucking do that? It takes half a joule of fucking energy. Take your fucking stick, put it up, put it down. Let the rest of the fucking people know what you're doing. What the fuck is your problem? Fuck! Thanks for joining me for another episode of Raging with Matt. Why can't you fucking assholes wait five seconds at the goddamn intersection for me to go past you? Why can't you wait five goddamn seconds? Tell me that. Why do you have to cut me off on the fucking highway where I have to hit my brakes to prevent myself from running into your fucking ass? Why can't you wait five goddamn of your precious fucking seconds? You have a death wish? I don't! So slow the fuck down, wait five seconds for me to pass, then you can go on with your merry day. Okay, you fucking asshole! Yeah, it's Raging with Matt, another fucking episode. Who gives a shit? What the fuck is your problem when I'm going into the Home Depot with my cell phone and you tell me, put the cell phone away, stop texting, and have a conversation with the wife instead? You know what, asshole? I got my fucking shopping list on my phone. I'm not even texting. Who the fuck are you to tell me to get off my phone, you old wrinkly piece of shit? Mind your own fucking business. You don't know who I am. You don't know how much I talk to the wife. You don't know how much I text. Maybe I use a digital fucking platform to keep notes instead of a pen and a piece of paper. You ever think about that, you fuck? Yeah, it's me again, I'm fucking raging, okay? Who the fuck are you, bitch, to tell me that I can't leave my dog in the car for 10 fucking minutes while I go into Walmart to buy fucking dog food for my dog that I love, and your fat ass comes along and tells me, oh, you can't leave your dog in the car like that, you know, fuck you. It's not even a fucking sunny day. It's overcast. It's 20 goddamn degrees outside. All four windows are down. What the fuck do you want? The royal treatment for a canine? Fine, you take my dog, bitch. You take him home, you pay the vet bills, you buy the food, and you suck his ass. Holy fuck, it's Matt, I'm raging again. Let me tell you why. What the fuck is your problem, you fucking pin dick? Stop fucking passing bikers, speed fucking bikers that are all lined up on the side of the highway. It's 80 fucking clicks there, okay? You don't pass them. Any fucking 16 year old dimwit knows you treat a fucking bicycle just like you would treat a fucking car. You wait. You wait two seconds for the people that are coming in the oncoming lane to pass you before you fucking pass the bikers. You come into my lane and almost fucking head on me. Why? Because you can't wait two fucking seconds to pass the bikers? What the fuck is your malfunction? Fuck you and everybody you came from. Ooh, I'm fucking raging. It's Matt, and I'm fucking raging again. Let me tell you why. What in God's fuck are you thinking when you pass somebody in the slow lane? I'm going 130 kilometers an hour. That's not fast enough for you? You gotta pass me in the fucking slow lane? What the fuck? Where are you going? Where are you going that you're that much in a hurry? Call a fucking ambulance if it's an emergency. Pull over to the side of the road, 
get your fucking dick out of your own ass and call a fucking ambulance. 130 is too slow? Fuck you. That's how fast it is, okay? It's fucking 100 fuck kilometers an hour, you fucking shit fuck. You fucking bitch ass fuck shit. Fuck. Oh my God. You know what fucking makes me rage? Let me tell you. People that drive around, especially on the fucking highway, filming themselves making video. Whoops. Hey guys, it's Matt. You're uh, tuned in to Raging with Matt. I've been getting a lot of comments of why are you raging so much? Are you on steroids? Have your testicles shriveled up to the size of raisins? All good questions and comments. Um, let me explain to you why, uh, the, where the raging videos came from and, and the kind of the thought behind them. It's actually a, a fairly uh, interesting story. So, once upon a fucking time, I decided to make a fucking video because I wanted to rage. Who the fuck are you to tell me I can't? Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, and the horse you rode in on. Yeah. Tuned in to fucking Raging with Matt. Who gives a shit? All right? What the fuck is up with people passing transport trucks? Okay? I understand you want to go around them. I go around them too. They have limiters. They can't go faster than 100. Everybody wants to pass them. But if you're going to fucking pass them, pass them at more than 101. What the fuck is your problem? A hundred's too slow, so I'm gonna fucking dilly dally my way around this transport truck going 101. So the guy behind me who's going a reasonable 110, which is a perfectly reasonable passing speed, has to fucking let go of his cruise control. Oh! Oh! Hello there, my friends. It's uh, Raging with Matt. I'm, I'm trying really hard not to rage today. My doctor's telling me that my blood pressure's up and my heart rate's up and uh, my arteries are clogged and it's all related to my stress level. So I'm, when I start to rage, I'm telling myself to just think about something peaceful. You know, some people think about a forest or a calm blue ocean or whatever, and then breathe. Breathe in for three seconds and then out. Three seconds in three seconds out three seconds in three seconds you fucking asshole you fucking bastard you cut me off I'll fucking kill you I will fucking end you yeah raging with Matt whatever the bullshit is we do here what the fuck is up with old people that need to pull over to the side of the fucking road okay unpaved shoulder type of fucking pulling over because I want to go the speed limit. You want to go 75. I get that. You're old. You're fucking stupid. I get it. Speed up! All I want to do is go the fucking speed limit. Why do you have to go five less? Why? You're making it more dangerous that way. Everybody else is going 80 or 90 or even 100 which is reasonable it's your fine you want to go 100 cops pull you over it's your ticket but you know what they probably won't pull you over for 75 and you old fucking geezers are taking advantage of that shit your old fucking lady's gonna tell you just pull over to the side of the road Henry no pick up the fucking pace Put down your fucking foot and drive at a reasonable rate like everybody else. And I know, I know what you're thinking, old people. I know what you're telling yourself. You're telling yourself, oh, that old fucking humdinger behind me, he wants to go 80. That's nice, dear. Fuck you, you fucking geezer! Get the fuck out of my way! Hey, it's Raging with Matt. I, I'm, I'm really trying hard not to rage today. Um, it's just, 
I, I can't I can't keep it up. I can't keep up this level of energy and animosity towards people I don't know. It's not fair. It's not fair for me. It's not fair for my heart. It's not fair for other people that I don't know. I mean, get fucking fed up with their bullshit and they'll have to fucking end their lives because they fucking pissed me off. What the fuck? You've been driving since you were 16 years old. Why at 50 do you forget a basic fucking thing like driving? Do you forget how to ride your bike all of a sudden when you're 18? No. You never forgot, right? That's where this saying comes from. It's just like riding a bike. Well, guess what? It's just like driving a car. You've been doing it since you were a teenager. How do you forget? How do you get shittier at it with age? Get the fuck off the road. Raging with Matt again. What the fuck is up with these fucking road signs? Why is there construction everywhere I go? What? What are you fucking looking at? You fucking teenage bullshit. You're nothing. Keep fucking driving. What are you looking at? I'm complaining about the construction. But now... I'M COMPLAINING ABOUT YOU! Yeah, it's mad, I'm fucking raging, yes, I'm raging again, okay? What the fuck is up with jeeps that want to ride your ass on the two-lane highway when there's nobody else on the fucking road? There's nobody ahead of me, there's nobody on the side, the only other fuck around me is you in your fucking Jeep, and you gotta ride my ass. Why? And why is it always a fucking Jeep? Why can't it be a fucking Mercedes or a minivan? Why can't it be a convertible? Why is it always a fucking Jeep? What is so interesting about my ass? It's Matt, and I'm raging. Let me tell you why. Everywhere I look, there's some fucking asshole that wants to drive with his hazard lights on. You know what the fucking hazard lights mean? It means you are a hazard and you need to get the fuck off the road. It does not mean I get to drive with my yellow lights on. You're not a fucking rolling hazard. You're a fucking hazardous piece of shit. Your car sucks and you get to, you need to get the fuck off the road. You got me so fucking raging right now, I can't even talk. Take your fucking hazard bullshit off the road and fuck off! Hey guys, Raging with Matt, Matt here. Before I wrapped up the first season, I wanted to um, answer some of our viewer questions that we've got here. So, number one on the list is from Codflipper28. Codflipper asks, Matt, why are you raging all the time? What is up with that? Let me answer that for you, Cod Flipper. Or should I say Dick Flipper? The reason I'm raging all the time is because it's not roids. It's not roid rage. It's actually internal rage. It's a diagnosed illness. I am a full-blown rageaholic, my friend. So. Hopefully you can understand um, where I'm coming from and why I want to rage and get this out on the videos. It's therapeutic, you fucking narrow-minded piece of shit. Don't ever fucking write me again. Let me take another question here, now that we got that bullshit out of the way. Prick Flap at Prick Flap. What kind of fucking name is that? Prick Flap? Really? Anyway, Prick Flap asks, can't you take medication for that rage? Yeah! I could take medication, just like your mom could have taken medication to prevent you from being a waste of fucking space on the earth. Tayside48 asks, what the fuck is your problem? What the fuck is your problem? Why isn't everyone else making rage videos? You guys are bottling up your rage, man. Not good, not good, because one day that rage is gonna fucking explode on you like a hundred thousand ton fucking tank dropping from the sky on your ball sack. Do you want that? I don't. That's why I make these rage videos. So I don't have the problem. You have the problem.
Razo Pizzazzo asks, why do you spit all over the place when you talk? First of all, I don't spit all over the place. Some liquid, some saliva might come out of my mouth when I'm raging, but I'm raging in this direction, you fucking idiot. Where do you think the spit's gonna go? It's called physics. You think the spit's gonna go behind me when I'm facing this way? Think, you fucking moron. Next question. AK47bro asks, man, what? where do you guys come up with these fucking names? Do you not have a creative bone in your body? AK47bro? Really? Fuck boy? All right. He asks, why don't you get a vehicle that's more conducive towards anti-rage? What does that even mean? Anti-rage is not a thing. It's called calmness. If you're not raging, you're fucking calm, moron. And the other thing is, don't use words like conducive. You don't even know what it means. You know what? My foot's conducive for your ass. Next question. Julie Serrano, hey Julie. Julie Serrano asks, hey, aren't you that Andy Diabete guy? You really remind me of him. Oh, I do. Yeah, really? You know what, Julie? You remind me of a fucking slut. You're a bitch. What the fuck do you know? Andy Diabetti's got nothing on my rage. Besides, Andy is a full-blown roidaholic, for real, for real. I've got an anger problem. It's actually more than just anger, it's a rage issue. And I acknowledge that I have it. So fuck you, Julie! Next question, now! Ryan777 asks, is there anything that helps your rage? I have rage too, and nothing seems to help. I'm wondering if you found anything that helps you to calm down. It's a good question, Ryan. Why don't you ask a fucking doctor? Do you ask a crazy person how to get well? What the fuck? Think. All right. I only have enough patience and energy for one more fucking question, so make it good. Blue Baloo asks, doesn't your throat get raw after you keep screaming like that for hours on end? Yes, it does. But all I have to do is just, um, um, that was a fucking stupid question. Of course it gets raw. I'm screaming at the top of my fucking lungs. Come on, man. Oh, I have had enough of you fucking idiots. I'm done. I'm done. I'll see you around. Maybe never. I don't give a shit. Fuck off. Hey, guys. It's Raging with Matt. Well, that was a fun few episodes first series or season, whatever the fuck you want to call it, I don't care. I don't really feel like raging right now because, hey, we got a whole new series under our belts on this channel now and I'm pretty fucking happy about it, so no raging from me today, guys. Thanks for watching. Appreciate your viewership and your audience ship and your, your fucking bullshit. <laughs> fuck you.